Stefano Pilati was born in Italy, but he certainly knows all about the French twist that makes Yves Saint Laurent so special. One thing that I think is very strong in a YSL collection is that it's as much about the mind of a woman as it is about the body of a woman. Yes. What did you get from that show? Well, I think that's the whole symbol of YSL, is the woman with a kind of assertive attitude and the woman who um, has a mystique about her. And I, th I just love how the brand really represents a confidence and a sort of intense femininity. Seemed like it had his signature flourishes, but really refined, absolutely beautiful. Loving this business happening underneath the tops. The colours, I mean, the colours are just. And then the elegance yeah. of the black evening stuff there was just so yeah. extraordinary. Isn't it? Yeah. Quite dark. But gorgeous. It's just refined elegance, but in a really modern way, and I'm such a YSL fan. I mean, I have been for a hundred years, but I mean, I think that Stefano does an incredible job. And I just loved kind of the simplicity in the clothes and the architecture, but it's also true Parisian elegance, which of course is my favorite thing. I have to say that I didn't notice that much about the clothes because I was just staring at the shoes. The metallic shoes. Had to had to raise my eyes. Those big gold. I just kept staring at them. So then, when the girls passed through again, I saw their clothes, and they were beautiful as well. There's an aura of magic about Saint Laurent somehow. I mean, I don't know if it's just because our subjective view of it was having come across the years, but there's a continuity to it. And a dark twist. A little dark twist, always. There's an aura of scandal. <laughs> oh, oh.